hi and welcome back with a new task uh, this task and this task we are given and uh, to work on a column ID we have to make an auto increment column and we are asked to make ID column as the identity unique column okay let's first understand what are unique columns and what's the difference between a normal column and, a, and an ID column okay so you see now we have a uh, one two three we have an id column but it can it allow two again the repetition yes it's allowed so if now it's two what is the difference between all these records now if i enter abc here now we have two persons with same name what is the difference if they both live in same house let's say it's a mistake so what will be the difference between this row and this row there should be a, a column that must be identified uniquely so if one is entered here one should not repeat again it should not allow one here you can enter two or something other than one and two now for the third column there should be a value something other than one and two three okay uh, it could be 4, it could be uh, 41, but something other than 1 and 2. The values must not repeat. So this is known as uniqueness in databases. <clears throat> in SQL Server, to achieve this technique, what we will do? Let's work on it. We'll open our table in Design View. And we will place our cursor on id come into the properties okay and scroll down search for identity specification okay open this it's asking is identity click yes yes it is identity um identity increment okay one identity seed one we will understand what the increment is what the seed is but let's for just for now just save it and let's test our changes okay we'll understand it in more detail now can i write something in here no it's not allowing me to write anything i'm trying to press the keys but it's not allowing me okay mr jkl will complete our whole abc for here uh, this is mr jkl who lives in uh, where should he live town okay and he has a phone number 555 okay i'm going on the next row it should save automatically and you notice the four has come here by itself i didn't write anything i did not write anything let's give it more one more try mr i'm a no he also lives in house okay he lives in house too and phone number something like six 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 five now the numbers are increasing one by one with an increment of one okay with an increment of one now let's change its properties come into design view again select the id column just place the cursor in id column come into identity specification identity increment it's one set it to three okay now what will happen let's check let's it's already opened in edit mode let's enter a new column here QR okay let's see he also lives in town and he is a phone number 777 come on the next row the ID generated is 8 because we had set the number 3 in increment right 5 plus 3 equals to 8 okay now I'm sure you would have understood the difference between increment and seed uh, if you haven't understood the difference between increment and seed so you'll understand it now from here 
the third task make id column as identity unique column we have done this right start values from thousand okay now this is seed start value the seed value should be thousand this task in this task we are asked to set our seed values to thousand okay should have increment of two like thousand one thousand two one thousand four one thousand six so on okay let's achieve this task the seed value should be thousand right seed value start value should be thousand so we set the seed value thousand how much should be the identity increment it should be two the even numbers set it to two okay now we are done save it let's check our changes okay mr let me enter my own name there where do you live i live in um on earth i live on earth right 888 what will be the number thousand the next number should be 1002 mr stu uh he lives in usa and 999 <clears throat> let's check this number 1002 so we have achieved this task by using identity specification feature in sql server um, i hope you have learned uh, about uh, how can you create your columns and auto increment column and how to make identity um, by uh, that should increase by itself and how to use seed and the increment properties uh, thank you for being with me thank you